Hi Scorpio, hope you're doing well. Happy birthday and this is your general reading for November 2018. Let's get right into it. Scorpio, what's happening with Scorpio in November 2018? Money, I think, but let's figure this out. Wow, you're getting a lot of pentacles here. Ooh, they're all pentacles. Guys, that's crazy. Okay, so the first card I have here is King of Pentacles. If you're not dealing with uh, um, somebody out of the Earth group, which is Taurus, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, this could be something in regards to money. Literally a financial situation. I feel like, honestly, for some reason, uh, this month is going to be focused on finances. I apologize to those that are expecting a love reading. You know, I don't know what it's going to be like when I pull cards, when I shuffle. This one seems all about money or, um, fine, you know, finances, work, maybe. Uh, looking for jobs, getting a job, maybe even losing a job. Okay, let's see. Why is King of Pentacles here? The Emperor and Knight of Swords. So, um, one way I can interpret this, you guys could be getting news from an authority. Okay, very quick news, very expected or unexpected but it's going to come to you fast knight of swords is bringing it very fast energy very uh aggressive almost and it could be from an authority it could be from the management boss you know uh whatever you do right now uh and it could be about stability it could be about money now however at the same time for those of you that aren't expecting anything from authorities or you just know that you're not going to really get any kind of information here, this could be an opportunity that might show up to take either your finances under control, your stability, security. This could be an opportunity almost like, okay? Now, I do have five of pentacles as the next card and this is not a very... <laughs> pleasant one to see here you know especially next to king of pentacles which is all about financial abundance which is all about security and stability five of pentacles kind of takes you a step back so with this card what do we normally have we normally have some kind of a financial loss sometimes we emotionally don't feel quite well um it, it is a loss of something okay i'm sorry to be telling you this for your birthday month so why is five of pentacles here and I have Queen of Cups and Judgment. You might find yourself in a little bit of a difficult situation, which situation which could be emotionally draining for you, okay? But with the Judgment, it makes me feel like this is going to be solved and the issue will not be existent anymore. Because Judgment gives you a second chance to fix uh, some problems that you're going through, whether it's at work or in your personal life. Judgment gives you a second chance and then the changes are followed by this second chance that's provided to you. So there might be a situation towards the middle of the month where you can feel a little bit uncomfortable when it comes to your finances maybe when it comes to your situation if there is some kind of information from authorities that you might receive it could be your initial reaction to it may not be uh, positive okay however with judgment you will be able to fix things you will be able to maybe get a second chance to prove yourself to the authorities potentially or maybe a second chance to improve your situation at work you know and i'm not getting too much into it you know this could be many many things this could be um, uh you know somebody leaving uh your group you know the job and maybe you're not okay with that. You have to replace somebody. Uh, somebody is, I don't know, they could want to fire you. You know, there could be a situation where it's not really your fault, but you could get accused. You know, this is just, I'm just kind of giving you examples. This could literally be complete restructure of the company and you're not satisfied with the changes within the company, okay? The next card I have here is Queen of Pentacles. I told you, it's all about, it looks like it's all about jobs and finances and 
interesting yeah queen of pentacles has similar meaning to king of pentacles it's also about this financial abundance uh your possessions okay knowing that um knowing that you're all set basically feeling stable feeling secure feeling financially free there could be um a, like a main theme of the month about your possessions something in regards to your possessions that could be uh go th that could go through changes okay something that you own um but let's see why is uh, queen of pentacles here justice well that's good and page of pentacles that's also good uh guys for those of you that are going through court cases suing somebody needing to get uh whatever is owed to you back okay this is going to be a great month to solve that issue to get paid you know to receive that loan back to win the case okay especially if it has something to do with property with your positions with the financial uh, matters this is going to be a great month to go through that to deal with it and to complete it okay you do have a benefit coming here with page of pentacles this could be a message this could be you know a raise at work if you are dealing with work um, or balance coming in when it comes to your job when it comes to the environment the work environment uh, this could be a little bit of a push or a little bit of a reward uh, or just a, an information coming through about things happening things working out in your favor so even though you might you might kind of experience this bump this bump <laughs> you know towards uh, maybe the middle of the month however it does look very smooth it does look like it's going to get solved and especially if you do have some legalities going on in november it's also going to be a great time to finally finish to get what you deserve and all that stuff and I the last card here is ace of pentacles can you imagine guys all of these are pentacles crazy but this is a new opportunity this is a financial opportunity this is a race this is a new job this is maybe you getting along with authorities this is you uh, making a purchase or finally selling that house you know finally selling that car some kind of a financial benefit, a reward, maybe not necessarily financial. It could be a more of a broad meaning of this card, like a new beginning, um, a chance to, you know, uh, bring more stability into your life, or something like that. So why is Ace of Pentacles here? You know, it all ends well. It definitely all ends well. And it looks like, you know, this new beginning was a little bit difficult uh, to reach you see you were in stagnation for a while you were maybe even in that mental imprisonment or the circumstances were making you feel kind of uneasy you know you thought it would never end there was a lot of conflict going on maybe with others maybe inner conflict it was pretty difficult okay it has been until this point but i want to reassure you that uh, it does end with ace of pentacles so you will get some kind of a reward that you've been waiting for beautiful so what is the outcome for scorpio for november 2018 queen of swords king of cups and two of wands high priestess knight of wands strength wow there could be something that was happening behind the scenes for a while or will be happening or is still happening you could have been working on something behind the scenes okay but however high priestess is also about something that is about to come up and you maybe don't expect it yet and it's going to be a surprise to you in november now i do have queen of swords in your outcome so this is you yeah maybe being emotional but this is you turning on your head and logic and rationality and um just doing things right this time being very strict about what you want how you're gonna do these things being very rational okay that's pretty good and again this could uh, this could hint at legalities that you could be going through now i also have king of cups upright beautiful so this is your emotional stability on top of you getting stable financially i want to say this is also a great month for uh stabilizing your emotions uh, maybe feeling like yourself okay if the king of cups was 
in reverse i would be like okay so try to tone that down you know tr tone down your emotions calm calm down things are going to get resolved but no i feel like you're going to be fine you're going to take it like a champ everything is going to be great and two of wands so here's more planning here is more dreaming even how you want to see your future what you want to have in your future it is a card of planning you know it is being at the crossroads sometimes but it's not being lost um, at crossroads if anything you're going to have more opportunities in your in your life to build a better future to plan for the better future really really exciting guys i'm sorry this has nothing to do with love love did not come up here at all thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you in my next video Bye bye